Welcome to State of Decay 2, Juggernaut Edition. We played State of Decay 2 about four, four and a half years ago, whenever it came out. I played on XCOM Game Pass, I believe, and we played it all the way through on Standard, but it's been a very long time. There's been loads of updates, and the Juggernaut Edition is on Steam, so and I never played it on Steam, so for all intents and purposes, brand new game, no progress in this game at all yet on this version. So I want to have a look at it. It's one of the games that I selected to pre-record for when I'm on holidays. So, but the first episode, I want to show before, I'm probably going to post it pretty close to after I record it, but the rest will probably come closer to when I go on holidays. But let me know in the comments below what you think, if you want to see more. Anyway, let's get started. State of Decay 2, Juggernaut Edition. Okay, we're going to start a new community. We're going to skip the tutorial. The most recent update at the time of recording uh, completely graphically overhauled the three original maps. So I'm going to pick Mega Valley because I believe it's also the most easiest map to play on. And that's not bad for trying to get back into the game. When it comes to difficulty, though, we played standard before. I want to play at least Dread on the action and community difficulty. On map difficulty, I'm going to go with Lethal. It feels a little more balanced. So from what I've seen and did playtesting myself, the loot felt not overpowered but also not too scarce. You just had to make a bit of an effort and you might have to leverage trading more. And that seems absolutely fine. So that's the kind of balance that uh, suits me better. But Blood Plague is obviously the trade-off here. So if we play on standard, we only have 10 Plague cards, but Lethal has up to 30 and we're gonna have a lot more uh, Plague Zombies to deal with as well. So we'll see how that goes. If we have to lower it, we will, but that is the difficulty that I definitely wanna set out at first to play with. Now, when it comes to the community, I'm not going to do any rerolls. Whatever community we get, even if they absolutely suck, we're just going to have to stick with and then hire people who are better. So who do we have? We have Dory, Chad, and Junior. And look at that. We have some good uh, increased uh, stats in s stamina for all three of them. That's good. So they all have good cardio. Oh, this one already has an improved ability. Okay, scouting. That's lucky. And then shooting, shooting. So wits, we have at least somebody with wits. And fighting, they're all terrible. So we're all gonna level them up uh, with fighting. Excellent. Welcome to our starting community. And most of the traits, I don't actually know what they mean. So looking at the individual trait names means very little to me at this stage. And we're empty, again. So, whose turn is it to find more fuel? Not me. Last time I accidentally stumbled on a juggernaut. I got a better idea. We could just settle down here instead of moving on. I admit, it looks better than the last couple of towns we came through. Now that you mention it, it does feel kind of homey. It's settled. This town is where we'll set up our new base. We just have to find a spot that's defensible, maybe with some room to expand. Well, I can't agree more. Uh, it feels very homey. I mean, whenever I come into a new town, when I'm driving through and I see corpses and bones and intestines splattered across the street, I think that 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 feels homey. I, I, I want to live here. Absolutely. OK, so let's have a look at our car. It looks pretty banked up and um, we have food. We have medicine. So we need to find fuel and preferably something to repair the car with. So let's have a we look at everybody's home, backpack. And we need it right the heck now. My backpack is the smallest, which is not good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to see if we can switch backpacks. Who has the biggest Maybe backpack? Maybe we should just here? take the next place we come across. Oh, you only have six. Okay, we need Dory. A new home, and we need sorry, it right the I'm gonna now. need your backpack. There we go. And I'm gonna give you my no backpack. Hang on a second. Can I can I not switch backpacks? Can I equip that? Yes. There we go. And then we can equip that. Beautiful. Just couldn't remember how to do that really. And then we give you some healing here back. Brilliant. Okay. So first things first. We know where nothing is. I don't actually know where things are. Um, I have no clue. So I can't go by memory and go. Oh, let's go straight here or here and get like a superpower weapon. I'm gonna go to the billboard. And that's how we're going to start. Observing the area. Get that cardio up while we edit. Always running. Oh, there's a screamer. Are you joking? 
Okay, so we want to make sure that we keep quiet. Screamer, better keep my distance. Well, he has his back turned, which is great. So this zombie I'm not too worried about. I just didn't want to trigger the screamer. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can get really quickly onto. Ah! Uh, I see a screamer. There we go. Okay, I was trying to grab him, but he turned. We have another one coming in from the bushes. Okay, excellent. Don't find in the bushes. I can't see anything. Whew, okay, screamers. Yeah, I like to kind of take them out when I see them, if I'm close enough, because if I forget about them, if I come back at a later stage, what happens is my brain goes, oh, this looks fine, but it's not. Okay, so... Oh, is that zombie coming up? No, okay. Oh, there's actually loot here as well. Yeah, that zombie hasn't noticed that, us. Do we have... Oh, close. Okay, great. They don't take up any room. Let's see what we have here. Oh, wow. Ammunition straight off the bat. Maybe well, we I'm going to give Shod everything first. Across. And let's have a look around. Yeah, the crap at White House, Green Bungalow. Is there any gas stations nearby? A few zombies there. I think that'll do it. Okay, I think. Oh, what's that? Huh. <gasps> I bet that thing still runs. Whoa. Okay. We definitely want to check this out. This this needs fuel as well. So. And this might have a bigger boot. Oh, this is sweet. If this is our first base, we have two cars to start off with straight away. Okay, so let's have a look and see what we found. Um, building materials, food, medicine. Oh, yes, fuel. So if we get a rock sack of fuel, we can break that down. And here we have medicine and some unknown. Okay, so what I want to do is before we get to our new home, I want to loot everything because we have three people, which means a lot of carrying capacity. And if we have two cars, it also means we can actually drive a car up, get the next car, drive it up and use that car to just dump everything in both cars. That is going to be amazing. Oh, man, that is probably one of the better starts I could, I could have imagined for. So let's try not to get anybody killed in the, in the opening and try to get this working exactly the way we have imagined. Okay, so we're going to loot all these houses on the way up. Let's start with that one. Let's deal with the Zeds. Ah, he's already taken care of. Beautiful. Yeah, that weapon is a bit short, I have. Does anybody of you have... I oh, know you all have... Baseball butts are always nice. Okay, so let's deal with um, this place here first. Let him cr come come to us, actually. There we go. Nice. Oh, one of the things they also added in the last update is an FOV slider. So I believe the default FOV is 70 in the game, but you can set it up all the way to 100. Um, I leave it on the default um, of 70. I'm feeling okay with that um, when it's too wide and you can't see too much sometimes it's kind of taken away some of the surprise effects you know when you go in somewhere or you go into a new area all of a sudden you, there's zombies you didn't see in the corner of your eye i find that much more thrilling and atmospheric even once i die let's start with this, this place hello anybody in here sounds like we're alone okay good so here we have a chance of getting a okay. builder rucksack. Okay. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna start offloading everything onto Chud first. see where next to here we go oh there's actually some loot out here there we go nice 
this. Now, once we have two rock sacks, I'm gonna. Oh crap! Yep, that's not good. I'm gonna skip over to the last house. Okay, let's deal with those guys. It gives us some fighting experience. Oh, yeah. Dory took care of it. Very good, Dory. Show them who's boss right in the foreface. In the open when it's daytime, I don't mind too much, unless we're in plague territory. Then we might want to not loot as greedily. Oh, very nice. A lot of stackables, I think, so far. Okay, I'm gonna give you the luxury we need items. A new home, and we need it right the heck now. And let's have a look through the house. Ah, okay. Oh, well, if there were zombies in the house, they would come out now. I guess that's good. Anybody else? Okay, cool. Yeah, usually I would not be as reckless. It's just in the opening, especially when the world is so bright and open. We have a lot of room. Be careful here. Can we smash a window, maybe? See if we can get somebody's attention. Anybody here? Yeah, I don't like tight spaces or fighting in them in these games. It makes me very nervous. Do we have some food here potentially? An eye out from behind us. Okay. They're very good, these strings. Do you know, I'm going to create a little bit more space. Um, I'm going to take the drinks on me as stamina. Look at that, man. Is that oh, for me? nice. Okay, so this is going to be good. Maybe now, we should let's just go take to Shadley for a second. Across. You give me that. I give you the stamina food. Give me back one more stamina food. We need a new home. Yeah, and we need I'm going to give you... Now. Hang on a second. I'm going to give you the stamina food. Excellent. And now we have actually one more free slots because I can put that into here. Beautiful. Okay, and Maybe I can we give you the, the screws. Inventory management. <laughs> it's, a, it's a mini game in itself, but I love it. It's, it's great. I love when you have to decide who to give what for because I don't really take a lot of followers with me. So this is only something you have to do in the beginning, I guess. Hey, or unless you take another follower with you. Like even on standard, most of the time I had a follower with me. I got them killed. Mm. Not very good in having them survive. Play. Okay, is that Maybe any of the bullets that stuck with what you have across. already? Excellent. All right, let's go. Let's head out. I can give the rucksack to I really Dory. hope we find a new home soon. So this is where we have the petrol, and here we have another potential sack for medicine. So why don't we do the petrol first? It's literally beside it. And that way we can um, break this down and then take the other rock sack as well from this house. Is anybody in here? Oh, there we go, yes! Gotcha! Beautiful. Oh, that looks like an ammunition crate. That would be pretty sweet. A luxury item, okay. Some ammo maybe in here? Oh, a box mine. Holy balls. That is amazing. There's a lot of sets here. Oh, I can see you. You're gonna have to get out. Okay, so let me break that down. Excellent. Now, is there anything that stacks with you? No room for that. I really hey, Dory, what about you? Soon. Excellent. I'm gonna take give you that so I can take that back in the top slot. No, let's be careful. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, my weapon is so short. I feel better if I can just slide behind them and execute them. 
There's another buddy. Ah, he's seeming. Ah, there you go. Dory didn't even wait. She's like, nope, don't even waste your time. Is that a working car? Oh, that would have been nice. Two cars. Three cars straight away. <laughs> Let's see what we have here. It's already starting to get dark, so we might want to risk loot a little bit faster because so even if zombies quiet. are coming, it shouldn't be that many. And these guys can deal with them in the meantime. Uh, Dory got this. Maybe we should just take the next place we come across. Where should I put this? Oh, they don't stack. Okay. Oh no, I accidentally drank one of my uh, stamina. Oh, that doesn't matter. That's great. It's locked. Gotta be quieter. Um, anybody in here? No. Just keep an eye out from behind us. No, it's not good when it's too quiet. Oh, a letter. Printed elephant on front. Printed on front. Of course I never forgot your birthday. That's impossible. Handwritten inside. Gail, I know I screwed up. But I promise I never forget again. I think we can actually... Um, I really these. hope we find a new home soon. Sorry. Can't carry yeah, that. I think he has seats. We've got to find a place to settle down. No way yeah, I can fit excellent. this. Excellent. Two more lootables here. Okay, luxury item. If we get both cars up, that is a lot of room. Excellent, and here's the medicine rucksack. Let's quickly check through these. From here, oh, there's one more lootable. Yeah, it's time to look elsewhere. Hey, yeah, that was nothing. It was the best nothing though I found so far. Okay, I think that's it. We looted all of this. So let's get back to this car first. And that means we can also loot the actual buildings there right beside it. Let's go down the street and then across. Oh, there's more loot here. Very nice. Kill a few more zombies on the, on the way. Increase our fighting skills because I think all our fighting skills suck. She's seen us. Okay, let's head right across here. Careful with the bushes. I don't like when zombies are in them and we get overrun. Okay, there's another building here. No screamers or anything. Okay. Nice. So all these stealth attacks actually increase our wit, which is awesome. Okay, where's the car? Yeah. Right out front. What do we have in here? Looks like we're in the clear. This side may contain something, okay. There's only one loot container in it. Okay, a firecracker. And we're gonna do the house in a second. Let's look around. Is there anything else to loot? There's a big shed as well. This place looks empty. Okay, no lootable. Before we loot the house, we're gonna see what the story is with the car. What is the trunks? Oh, it has a toolkit in it as well. And it has fuel. That is amazing. That is so awesome. Okay, so let's repair it first. So I can get the other car uh, later by myself if we need to, but this is really, really good. And let's fuel it up with fuel. Has a lovely big boot. Okay, let's put the bags in. Come on, guys. I really hope we find a new home soon. Is there anything Sorry, that stacks with what you have? That. No. 
Okay, let's put the bag in here. We've got to find a place to settle down. Nowhere for that to go. Okay. Let's put the fuel can in here. And what is really heavy? All this is pretty light. The firecrackers might be heavy. What does that equip? I don't see anything we can equip. Okay. Now, feeling a bit better. Let's go into the house. We're bound to find something here. <laughs> Side may contain that hammer. I think that icon means that there's no bags, but just generic loot. Oh, what is that? A blunt melee weapon. Eight pounds? It's pretty heavy. So, let me see. Yeah, but I like that one. That is nice. I think blunt weapons like that can hit more than one zombie if you have uh, more than one in front of Locked you. Up tight. That was graceful. Okay. Easy there. Give it a chance. See if anybody's coming. Okay. Let's have a look through it first. Kill, kill any zombies before we loot it. I should probably always do that. Nobody around the corner here. Hey. All clear. Okay, good. There's 10 loot containers in here. What? That is insane. I don't think we have room for all of that stuff. And then I have to offload some into the car then, I guess. Don't Another note. That. Yeah, I don't have room for this. So, let me see if anybody can take anything else. Where should I put this? I really hope we find a new home soon. No room for that. Okay, we're gonna have to use the car. And then come back here and see if we can loot the rest. Okay, let's put the... Okay, these all stack nicely. So, luxury items don't stack. So, let me just... Yeah, we can keep all that. That should stack nicely. Okay. Let's see, we take as much as we can from this building with us. Okay, more ammunition. That could be ammunition that actually stacks on one of the other guys. Oh, fireworks. Okay, more jokes. Molotov cocktails. I know one of you had Molotov cocktails. There's definitely one or two things that stuck across. with one of you. No room for that. No, no ammunition stacks with you. There we go. Sorry, can't carry that. Yeah, so I have only one more slot. Ah, uh, no. And then we, ooh, and then so we're done. Quiet. I'm already full up. Yeah, that's another luxury item. Okay, guys, we have a full car. We're gonna have to deal with the zombies. And then we're gonna take this car and come back with the other car and fill that up. Okay, guys, I was perfectly fine executing her. Oh, hello. Somebody's in the house, I guess, from the back door. Oh, there he is. Okay. It's come. I want to come back to this house, though. Um, is there anything I can offload here that stacks? No, I think the seeds do stack this, uh, it should. To down. Okay, let's go. Maybe I take the rest of the buildings by myself. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. So, we're gonna drive up these this car here. Do we have the fuel? Let's take that. Yeah, let's deal with this guy first. 
Nope, he saw me. That will work. Yeah, followers are always in the way. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Let's take that rucksack and We've give it to, to settle down. Guys, and let's take this rucksack. Let's to We Dory. need a new home and we need it right the heck now. I know. But it means I can now refuel this car as well. And I think there's nothing left in this car. No. Okay, I'm gonna come back for this car, but I'm gonna drive it up a little bit. So I don't have to drive back too far. So let's leave it right here. And then we're gonna drive to the base with this car, and that way I don't have to drive uh, run too far. Okay, you know what? You guys deal with these. Man, oh, sure no, dead yet. Nice, lovely. I hope we're all okay. Let me see. Shot is he injured? Missing chunks of flesh damage taken. Yeah, we're gonna put you home. Um, don't worry. And then we're going to take Dory out later to get the rest, uh, the car and uh, the rest of the loot. So let's leave these guys here behind. Let's get into the car. It's a bit heavier to steer than the other car, but it makes sense. It's a bigger car. Okay. Oh, we could go back right away. Awesome. Okay. Here. Okay, stamina, stamina, stamina. There we go. Okay, let's go and get the other car. There we go. Keep an eye on that stamina. I don't want to have stamina drink selected just in case. Beautiful. Yeah, there we go. Ah, oh, these guys can take care of it. Okay. Get this car as well. Beautiful. So I can use the van actually to loot the local areas, and then when I want to explore, I can use the car, which is a little bit more nippy. Assuming we can get it repaired. There we go. Nice. Two cars. Not a bad start. Okay, so let's put. Um, oh yeah, we can't put everything away yet. Are these guys all coming for us? Okay, they're kind of not getting bothered. Okay, let's take Sky over the house. And I'm getting started. <sighs> okay. Let's have a look here. In the shed first. All this needs is some fortification. But we I got ourselves a new Zombie here, let's go up. They're all outside. 
This place looks good to me. Excellent. Time to stake our claim and move in before okay. someone else shows up. Brilliant. Claim home site. I can support that plan. We had really amazing luck with the cars. Our first priority has to be gathering materials. Absolutely. We'll need them to improve this place. Need you to take a look at what's out there. Let's put everything away. I'm gonna put the bandages away and get painkillers. And let's talk to the other guys to take their stuff. And put it away. Yo, got a bunch of supplies for us here. Very good, we got medicine. And let's talk. Oh, I just took everything from him. Where is Dory? Dory? Where are thou? Oh, she's outside. Okay. Let's go out to the cars. Yo, I'm heading out. No, you're not. You're just emptying the truck. There we go. Hey, everything seems just all right here. I'm glad to hear it. It's Excellent. Time to get building. Either a workshop or an infirmary would be a great place to start. Okay, so let's have a quick look at our uh, materials. We have basically everything except fuel and ammo. Our, mo our morale is... Um... Oh, Dory actually gives us a moral bonus because of movie trivia. That is amazing. That is really sweet. Okay, so I would say um, repair this and clean this and we have eight building materials. So get a workshop going first on infirmary first. Let's do the infirmary first I'm because we have people that are injured and then we can put a workshop here. Real. And then here, I'm not really sure. We'll see what we get uh, room for. Okay, get the work started straight away. I think noise levels hey, are still fine. Uh, yeah. You mind sending a little help this way? I'll see you in a bit. Okay, Thanks. let's see. I'm um, at this time not really uh, ready to um, help you guys. So as far as I understand, these quests can wait. You don't. You're not in a rush with them unless they have a timer on it. You're absolutely fine. What I want to do first in this episode, which means this episode will go on a bit longer, I want to um, wait for the infirmary to be built put in whoever I need to put in, and then uh, take a person out with the big van and take the loot of the other buildings. And then if we have looted all of this, then in the next episode, um, we can have a look actually at these two things here, these two buildings. And um, then we're gonna move into this area job, here. Um, looting everything here, use the two billboards, the areas to overlook everything. And then what we need to do is we need to look out possibly for a food outpost. Because we have 13 food right now, they eat three a day, so we're fine at the moment. Now the infirmary is going to need uh, two meds a day, so we need possibly outposts for medicine and an outpost for food, from what I can see. Okay, so let's wait for the infirmary to be finished first. Are we doing on that? Oh, it's actually done. Okay, so plague treatment, no. So who do we need to check in? Nobody needs treatment. Oh, but Shut is kind of hurt, so Shut should stay at home. I might switch to Dory, I guess. So let me see, where's Dory? Let me find Dory and swap some things with her because I prefer them all having the blunt weapon. Yeah, Chud, you take it easy. You go to sleep, man. You, you take a rest. Dory, come here. Okay, so let's... Um, you give me this, and you give me this, and this. And I give you... This and this. I'm gonna give you the seven... Sorry, can't carry that. Oh yeah, of course. I'll make room first. I'll take this and I'm gonna get this. Excellent. Okay, and now we're gonna switch to take from Survivor. I think we can talk to her and 
switch to this character. Excellent. Use a break. Okay, so Dory is the one we're going to take with us now, and we're going to take the van out to the other buildings. Yeah, so this is the first episode that I'm going to post probably close to when I recorded it um, as normal, but the rest will probably follow uh, more up when I'm uh, on my holidays and uh, pre-record them. I just wanted to get a feel for the game and get your feedback because the problem is when I record things while I'm on holidays, I can't obviously respond to them in follow-up episodes. So I would like to get some feedback from you guys, you know, on what you think, if you want to see this game in the first place. Um, so I have a better idea, you know, what you guys enjoy as well. We're not going to take you because you're all broken. So let me have a look. We're going to start at this house here. I'm going to go straight here. Okay. Is the dude coming? No, he's actually already leaving. Oh, there's somebody in here, all right. Okay. Good. Looks clear. Okay, here we have a chance of getting more building materials, which is great. Oh, if we get more building materials, I think we should also um, have the other two guys hey, maybe do a cleanup worse. job on this. And that way we can start doing the workshop there. So from what I understand, the first things you always need to look for is or uh, sort out this is food. Is be a good day. Oh yes! Oh, and circuitry. Circuitry are great. They allow us to upgrade uh, things. Um, I think our infirmary or workbench or whatever it is. Okay. Let's right away put that in here. That is sweet. I'm not gonna even chance on doing a shift loot on this. Absolutely not. We're just gonna have to wait it out and be patient. Clear trash completed. Very good. She is a bit slower in searching than um, the other guy was. Can take that. And just have a quick look. So here we now can start workshop. Oh, yes. Oh, did we equip it? Yes, we did. That is beautiful. So we have an extra slot now. That is awesome. And we can give the other seven pack to um, one of our survivors who's using the six pack. It's quite a lucky find. Love it. We have been very lucky so far. And let's hope it stays that way. Oh, I can, I can see you. Um, if I, if I open it now, I think the zombie will fall on its face. No, there's two. Okay. Here's the other one. Nice. Okay. Stamina, stamina. Just watch out for the stamina. Let's keep an eye out behind us. Ooh, luxury item. Lovely. Yeah, I want to look through the rest of the house first before I loot something that is this wide in the open. One more room. 
Breathe easy. No more creepers oh, here. Oh, when it makes that noise, it's like, it, it's I don't know. Sometimes it sounds like one of the zombies rustling. I know it's distinctively different, but still, the moment it happens, I'm like, ah, zombie. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Nice. More stackable stuff. Love it. Loads of screws, actually, which is very good. Loads of parts. It's potentially going to allow us to craft some things that we need um, very soon. Oh, nice. Food. Food is very important right now until we have a food outpost. Maybe a garden I put I've in. I don't know. I've searched through everything here. Um, do you know what? I'm going to use this one. That was the last one. That way I stay topped up and I'm not using any of my uh, med kits. Uh, sorry, painkillers. Um, is that it? Was the no? Nope, that's it. Now, is this site of any value? No, just permanent safe area. And this is beds. Um, this is just permanent safe area. Scouting, beds, scouting, scouting beds. Scouting range. Yeah, that's it. So uh, none of these will probably give us a food uh, bonus in the outpost. Okay, let's actually put everything in here. Luxury items. I take the stackable stuff actually on me. For now. Okay, good. Next building. Actually, we might as well loot this flip building here. Stay hidden away. They don't know where I am, they just hurt the car. Oh, no, 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 I misclicked. Oh, no. I have to slow down. Ah, oh, damn it. I only have one left. Let's get that stamina going. I misclicked. I meant to, do, to grab and I ended up dodging and then I had no stamina. That was bad timing. These things happen. These things happen. Safe to go in. Okay, why don't we stay crouched and go through the rest of the house? Just in case there's more. Short has recovered from fatigue, very nice. Oh, a mechanical textbook consumed to learn the skill. Teaches one survivor the basics of mechanics or improves that survivor's mechanics, auto mechanics, or engineering skill. Mechanic unlocks workshop three and allows the crafting of toolboxes and box mines. That sounds like that was a very good find. Let's just hope we're not going to get her killed. I keep forgetting that her fighting skill is really trash, which I assume has something to do with. Just be careful. Keep an eye on that door. Okay, soda can bomb. We're good. Oh. Don't see any of them okay. around here. Any more loot? There's two more containers in this house. Ah, there we are. Oh, in the other room. And right here in the hallway as well. Okay. This side contains random things, so we're not going to get a bag out of this. Oh, nice. Every now and then, these things are nice to find as well because they don't take up an inventory spot. And fireworks.
comic book. Which one's heavier? This one. Oh, these ones are actually quite heavy. So I might actually take the letter instead. Okay. Oh, it's actually before I go into the car. Let's head over here. Into the shed. Oh, I can see the eyes. I can see the eyes. There we go. That's a screamer. Let's not make it upset. What? Where's the screamer? What? Where's the screamer? Oh, up there. Okay. We might take care of that guy on the way home. No more creepers. We're good to go. Okay. So here we might have a bug. We'll see. Could be good. Okay. That's ducks. Eye on the door. Ooh. Oh, that's a luxury item. I thought it was another book of learning. We could learn a skill. So I don't know if there is like a better person than another to learn the mechanic skill, if it's okay to just pick a random person or if the person you pick uh, should be someone with a specific trade or skill. But I'm not going to read the book now, I'm actually going to hang on to that and maybe you guys can let me know in the comments. So how far away is that screamer? He's, he's actually quite far away, we can deal with that screamer when we do that other house. Um, building whatever that is that other side uh, next episode you're not gonna do that tonight we go. okay is there anything we can stack no okay so we have room for two more things I could take uh, the painkiller. Now I don't want to waste really things either. So let's um, have a look here in this house and just take what we can. Mainly the container, mainly the backpack, I guess. That would be always good. Maybe someone would want this. Here breathing that could be outside. It could be in the next room. Yeah, there's nothing here. Is there anything on the floor here? This place no. seems safe for now. <sighs> okay. Let's see if we can find the bag anywhere. And then if we find the bag, we can um, put that in the van, and I think then we're pretty much ready. Oh! Now you're talking. Now, this, of course, is going to be very loud and noisy. So, not uh, very good. Yeah, then let's just look for the bag and then we can come back here for more stuff. Nothing we can use. Okay. Yeah, that, that breathing sounds like it's coming from the outside, from behind the house. Actually, there's a zombie right here beside the tree outside. Thank goodness. Something yes. we can use. Okay, is there anything else that we can do that's stackable? That would be, that would be great. Yeah, there's guys outside for sure. This is the last container, so let's see if we can take things. Let's head out. This place is picked okay. over. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this one. And I loot this. And if there is another building with a container, let me see. Oh, I didn't loot this one yet. That has more fuel. We need the fuel. So I'm going to go in and get the fuel back and leave the rest of the loot. So let me... Okay, so anything we can stack, I don't think so. Is there anything I can um, destroy? That would be worth destroying? I don't know. I don't think so. Unless we can reload all the ammunition. No. 
I really want to take one of the bags. Um, if we can't destroy loot, can we destroy loot? Um, oh, excellent. Yeah, I'm going to drop this. And that way I can uh, make room for some switcheroo. That's almost as much as go. I can carry. And now we can take one more rucksack. How much influence are these notes? Because they're kind of like uh, old world information, I guess. And will the loot stay there forever? That's another thing I want to check out. Oh, what's the shed here? Oh, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Did we attract too many zombies? Let's just go straight for the shed. Yeah, they're coming for the car, but they shouldn't come for me. Breathe easy. No more creepers here. Okay. Whew. See if we get the bag. If we, the moment we get something that we can't stack, we're gonna leave. Well, of course, once we have the bag. Keep an eye on this. I don't know if they can crawl through it. That's Excellent. That's almost as much as I can carry. I know. We're just gonna have a look and see if it's more crafting parts or building parts. Nice. This actually stacks. This is awesome. Empty. Okay. So we actually managed to loot this building completely. The only thing left behind is the notes. So zombies on the car. Yeah, I think we should take care of them, to be honest. Otherwise, the moment they start the car, they're gonna come after me. Okay, excellent. Now, oh, I thought we finished that house. There's one more container in there. Are you kidding me? I thought we searched everything. Oh, there. Let's see what we have in here. I wouldn't mind finding more circuits. Okay, great. Ah, oh, look at our wits going up. That is amazing. All right, let's go. Back to the house. And I think this was a very good loot run. Now, we wasted a little bit of ugh, medicine. And we could have done some things a lot better, I guess. But Oh, there's more loot. But we were very lucky with... Um, Where's the cars? I don't think these guys are actually... Fo oh, they are following me. Okay, they follow the car, so maybe they don't see me. What are you doing? Okay, you're just hanging around. Okay, here we go. Bomb. Bomb. Excellent. A repair kit. I might use that actually on the car outside. And we're gonna store that as well. I'm not gonna shoot off any guns yet. So let's have a look at our base. So our moral is down to minus five. Very good. So we got plus six. So we have minus ten dread community difficulty. But then we got plus nine. So how is that minus five and not minus one? Okay. So, fair enough. But we have everything except ammunition now, which is great. And we have plenty of food and medicine to last us a few days. Unless we have to actually send somebody in. And, yeah, that's it. I'm going to leave this here for the first episode. Again, let me know what you think. I'm um, home. The beginning is always the easy part. It's going to get obviously more complex later. There's a lot of things I don't remember uh, in the game, especially when it comes to, to mid to late game things. Uh, play cards and all that, that shouldn't be a problem. Uh, just the number of zombies, I guess. But overall, I think we should be okay. I'm actually going to use that repair kit on the other car before we leave. So we have a kitchen. We can um, do Russian management. We even can cook a meal that should boost mo uh, morale. Actually, can we do that? Let's see. Um, in in act rationing. No, 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 no. Prepare a feast. Make items produce food. Collect seeds. Produces box of seeds. 
Okay. Oh, what is this? Produce food? Boxes of seeds. Okay, so what we're looking for is actually cooking, but we don't have any knowledge of cooking. Okay. So let's repair this car here. And no, not upgrade car. Can I just repair it? Do not have the consume repair vehicle. Repair. There we go. Okay. Nice. And now we have doors at least that we can slam into zombies' faces. So what is this option here? Vehicle upgrade. Grab vehicle supplies. Oh, okay. Oh, that allows us to straight away access certain things from our inventory. Oh, load gas can complete. Minus two fuel. What? What did I just do? Did I put something into my car? Oh, I did. Oh, cool. Now, it cost us two fuel, which is not good, but we got four fuel from the bag. So that's that's not a bad trade off seeing that when we destroy the bag, we get only one one can. Um, destroying all four. So this is not too bad. Before I do any more things wrong or do any more things that are unexpected, I'm going to leave it here. Listen, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys had a good time with the episode. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls. And I hope I'll see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, fruit pass and happy gaming.